Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make Indian rice, only I'm going to be using cauliflower as the base. This recipe is really easy to put together. All you need is a pot and you want to turn on the heat to about medium high. So the oil that we're going to use today is coconut oil. And the wonderful thing about it is that it's actually one of the healthiest ones you could possibly use. Most oils, when they're cooked, they actually change biochemically and they become a lot acidic and more toxic to your system. However, coconut oil has a higher burning temperature, so it's a lot easier to use and it's also really healthy. So after we heat our pan, we're going to take the coconut oil, about an overflowing teaspoon, and put it in the pan. Once that melts down, we're going to add our onions. And you're just going to give it a good mix. And to the onions, you're going to add the spices. First we have about one teaspoon of turmeric. Just going to add that. Next, we're going to add some paprika. And lastly, some cardamom. You can probably find ground cardamom, but I, for some reason, couldn't find any, so I have some whole pieces here. It doesn't really matter. Either or, about a fourth a teaspoon. It's pretty strong stuff. Already, it smells really good. And you want to mix this until all the spices are evenly distributed across the onions. And we want to cook it until it's just translucent, and that's when we want to add our cauliflower rice. So I can see now that my onions are just about cooked, so I'm going to add our cauliflower rice now. All you need to do is take one head of cauliflower, separate the florets from the core, put it into a food processor, and pulse until it becomes this consistency. And as you can see, it's a lot like rice. It looks like it, but it's a little bit tougher. And that's why we're going to cook it, so it becomes softer and a lot more easy to eat. And this right here is actually about three quarters of a head of cauliflower. And that's just the color you want. So once everything's evenly distributed, I'm going to put a lid on this. But before I do that, I want to add a little bit of water, just so it helps cook the cauliflower and, and steam it in a way. So here I have about a fourth a cup of water. I'm just going to pour that in there. And give it one more good mix. Now it needs to cook for about two to three more minutes, and then it's done. Mm -mm -mm. So good. So it looks done right about now. And it's ready to serve. So let me put this down. The aromas are out of this world. You really have to be here to understand what you can color. A little bit of paprika. Every time I serve something, I try to make the colors contrast each other. So here you go, it's your Indian cauliflower rice. Just a small one. 